We literally asked you, our readers, the social media, and members of our team, what they thought the worst snacks in Animal Kingdom are. And man, you guys were ruthless. You delivered, that's for sure. Oh my goodness. Ugh. We are here in Animal Kingdom trying these snacks so you'll know what not to spend your money on and so we can suggest foods that we think will be a better alternative. Okay, right away, Miranda. Because, <laughs> you know, I, 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 I know this list, but I, but I have not told you this list. You yet. haven't. So, what do you think is going to be on this list? I think, uh, in my humble opinion, that uh, the, mm, I got to go in the Avatar with the. That's because we're walking that way. Well, I. Context clues. How dare you? I know context clues. I'm thinking uh, some pineapple lumpia, lumpia. You're absolutely right. That is one of the most. Uh, suggested worst snacks at Animal Kingdom. No oh, jeez. The cream cheese pineapple warm 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 spring. to be specific the it is warm, warm cream, cream cheese. cheese pineapple spring roll in Pandora. Yum. Let's go. Let's do it. We are here at Pagu Pangu which is in the world of Avatar. When you get off a of flight of passage you will enter into Wind Traders and then right next to there is Pangu Pangu. We are getting the Pangu Lumpia which is a pineapple cream cheese spring roll for $3.79. Ooh. So this one actually came from our team and all of you, our readers and all our peeps on social media. This is probably our most suggested worst snack here at Disney's Animal Kingdom. So it is literally a spring roll filled with warm cream cheese and pineapple. And there's uh, like light sugar on the top, just a little bit, just to sweeten it up a bit. But um, yeah. I'm really bad at this. Okay, hold on. Do, All right. do the things. Do the, do thing. the honors. It's Yep, it's gonna explode. Okay. Not bad, not bad. Okay. All Ooh. right. Ooh, Look at that. Nice. Look at that. All right. <laughs> You're so excited about it. Okay. Cream cheese does not taste like that. Very, 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 very small tapioca type of feet. Tapioca! <laughs> that is a great, that is a great uh, comparison to what this cream cheese tastes what, like. It's like very, very itty bitty tapioca feet. Tapioca! Yeah. Tapioca! Like rice pudding type thing, yeah. Rice, that is a, rice pudding, that is a great comparison. Yeah. Okay, well you guys put it on the list. Why is it on the, uh, the list of worst snacks here at Animal Kingdom? Uh, it's, it's the texture. I think it is. It's just the texture. The taste is fine in my opinion, but it's that weird texture that I know a lot of people would have an issue with. Uh, yeah. I also kind of have an issue with it. Me too. It's interesting. Not getting this, getting something else sweet here in Pandora. Let's rate this uh, um, worst snack. Uh, so from one, one to five, one being the absolute worst snack. I will never ever get this again to five. I actually liked it and you're wrong. Uh, <laughs> all right, three, two, one, two. Okay. Okay. okay, why two? It definitely has a weird texture. Uh, Flavor-wise, it's good for me. I just can't get behind the warm cream cheese tapioca. Yeah, and I, and I, th I think that's why I put it as a three because the taste is really fine. It really yeah. is like a nice-ish breakfast like okay. uh, thing. It's just the warm cream cheese that I it just it just kind of weirds me out. I think a sweet alternative uh, here in Pandora would be getting the Night Blossom. Agreed, agreed. I love the Night Blossom. It's delicious. You can get it alcoholic or non-alcoholic. Um, it has little boba pearls, popping pearls on top. So if you are a textured person, you can. They're not all the way through. Shall I move on? I guess. All right. We finally made it to Asia. Not actual Asia, but the Animal Kingdom Asia. Number one, hashtag live entertainment is important. Number two, Animal Kingdom is by far the most beautiful theme park. Next up, we are at the Anandapur and getting the Yeti Sundae. This Yeti Sundae is a chocolate soft serve topped with uh, vanilla soft serve, blue cake crumbs, sugar, sweet snowflakes, and a chocolate Yeti image. You can get this for $6.29. <laughs> the Anandapur food truck right here, ice cream truck, is in between Cali River Rapids and Mount Everest, kind of in the heart of Asia. Here we have the Yeti Sunday. We got a cute little uh, chocolate Yeti on top. Uh, lots of sprinkles though. I'm not not a fan of this sprinkle-ish, the sprinklage. Um, but let's give it a taste. It sounds intriguing. Did that just bubble? Okay. 
Okay, here we go. Or cake is I don't know. Okay, so why is this on the why is this not on the worst list? I think it's because one, it's messy. Uh, the sprinkle cake topping thing uh, gives it a weird texture almost. Um, I love an ice cream. Is this my favorite? Absolutely not. <laughs> no. I, I actually don't mind the sprinkles. The, the, it's good because it's a sugar sprinkle, so it kind of melts in a little bit, but uh, I can see where it's not a fan fave. Really, the issue is it's messy. Yeah. Like, that's the biggest thing. I it, mean, it it's is a just. top faster than we did. And I feel like the blue is going to dye our hands. Okay, so the Yeti Sunday. Yeah. Uh, it was interesting. It was, uh, for me, I actually didn't mind it. I agree with our readers and our, our social media peeps. That is why, I think because it gets so messy so quickly and the blue dye just goes everywhere. It does. This is definitely not something I would recommend for <laughs> younger ones. Now, I love ice cream. It is my uh, personal love language. Uh, best, oh. best dessert ever. However, with this one, I don't love the sprinkles on top. I love, and see what's weird is that I Birthday cake is my favorite ice cream besides cookie dough. Oh. So it's interesting that I don't like the sprinkles on top because I don't have a problem with texture. But I think it's because it's the blue, weird sprinkles. Um, if I could get past that, if there was not a whole lot of that, this would be perfect. This would be the best uh, ice cream ever. All right, one out of five. One okay. being the worst, five being the best. All right, worst snack. Here okay. we go. Uh, Yeti Sunday. Three, two, one. Ah! <laughs> yeah, why did you rate it a four? It's ice cream. I can't go wrong with ice cream. It's just the sprinkles that uh, Wait. cause it. Wait, oh God, there's, there's a bug. A there's a bee. For me, it's the price point of it as well. Like it's $6.29 for, eh. like, you know, it's it's a lot of money for just a Sunday, in my opinion. And it's not a great Sunday. But I, I, I didn't mind it. It's just like, I guess that's the right word. Like, eh. Eh. But a fun alternative for the uh, Yeti Sunday, which I know we both enjoy, is the Simba Sunset from Tamu Tamu in Africa. And the Simba Sunset is this really uh, it, nice. It's like a it's like a pineapple Dole Whip with uh, like some strawberry in there as well. We've got to go back to Pandora. Yeah, we we forgot about. We've got to go back. To, oh, here, it's on the other side of the. All right, let's walk quickly. Yeah. Ah, we made it back to Pandora. You don't have to, you don't have to squat. Sorry. You're good. <laughs> we made it back to Pandora, and uh, because our uh, another one of our top worst snacks is here at Wind Traders. Wind Traders is the gift shop right outside of uh, Flight of Passage. It's actually right next to where we got our very first snack uh, uh, over here, over here at Pongu Pongu, the um, uh, Pongu Lumpia. Well, let's head into Wind Traders to uh, find out what this uh, worst snack is. Is that it? It's a rock. Yeah, is it the lion? Oh. It's literally, this is a rock. Oh. This hurts. Oh no. Well sure, yeah, this is, well, this is what we're getting. It's the lion berry, a mixed berry flavored crispy the rice cereal treat. Fun to share, it says. Oh really? So. Well, we'll, we'll make that judgment for ourselves. <laughs> okay. All right. Well, yeah, this is it. Uh, this, this is what we're getting. It's the Lionberry Mixed Berry Flavor Crisp Rice Cereal Treat. This, this is this is your doing, everyone at home. So uh, let's uh, let's give it a shot. All right. This is the Lionberry Rice Crispy Treat. It was five forty nine. It literally looks like a rock. I guess we should try it. I suppose. Okay. Oh, oh. my God. Oh, it's blue. Okay. I had no idea it was gonna be blue in the middle. Honestly, that that was kind of cool. I'm here for that. That was actually kind of fun. <laughs> <laughs> uh, my hands are a mess, but like that's the inside. All right. Ew, it smells gross. Ew, ugh. Oh. No? No. Oh, that's like a giant. It's like a Fruit Loop. Yes! I was gonna say Fruity Pebble. Yeah. It's like a giant Fruity Pebble. The flavor is also not there. I think it's the purple frosting because you know how you get purple frostings on cupcakes are the absolute worst frosting flavored cupcakes? My hands are purple. Yeah, uh, I don't like it. It tastes like Fruity Pebble, <laughs> and not in a good way. For like almost six dollars, you're getting... Okay, all right, here we go. Count of three. One, two, three. Hey! Yeah. Wow, that's tough. Yeah, it was it, by far, uh, and I, I'm just park-wide, actually resort-wide, pre-packaged Rice Krispies treats are very low very. on 
on the worst snack list. Agreed. Yeah, get anything from Zuri's Sweet Shop uh, as, a, as an alternative to prepackaged Rice Krispie treats, especially the Lionberry here in Pandora yeah. at Wind Traders. They also have fun holiday treats as well. Like in the fall, they have fall flavors. In the uh, Christmas season, they have Christmas spices flavors as well and kind of decorations as well. So they got some snowmen, some Santa decorations on top of some of their treats and it makes it really fun and puts you in the spirit. Ready? Break. Ah. All right, so we've only got one more uh, worst snack here at Animal Kingdom that we're going to try out today. And I don't know if I would call this a snack. It is the one, the only, Pizza Fari. We are here at Pizza Fari, which is in Discovery Island, which is towards the left of the Tree of Life. So I think we are going to grab a pepperoni pizza here at the Pizza Fari. And it's also served with a small Caesar salad. We got the pepperoni pizza. It is very small. It's They call it a personal size. They cut it up into four different slices unevenly. Uh, you very, see? Very greasy. It looks very greasy. Which is not always a bad thing for pizza, in my opinion. Um, yeah. But it does come with a Caesar salad. And uh, you can have, you know, red pepper flakes and Parmesan and things like that. So um, I guess let's give it a try. Okay, so. Everyone said the pizza from Pizza Fari, which I don't know if I, this this is not this is kind of a snack. I guess I guess if you split it, yeah, it, it could be a snack. Right. Um, so that's not bad. Yeah. Uh, but it is famously one of the worst quick service, uh, like ever at Animal Kingdom. So we're gonna try the pepperoni pizza and see what goes on. Is it the worst pizza? It's cheese, dough, and sauce, and pepperonis. I don't... Pizza is pizza. I mean, it's not... It's it's is not it bad. bad. No. Is it bad? No. It's a pizza. Yeah, there are definitely... That's the thing, I think. If you're coming to Disney World, this is fun. You want to finish this... Um, You want to talk about this pizza not in this, like... Awful, ominous lighting. We really should move. Okay, let's let's go. Bye. Yeah. So for eleven twenty nine, for pepperoni pizza, you got a, you got a little side Caesar salad. Um, it could be a, a meal for one person, but definitely a snack for two people. Yes. Um, what are we doing? All right, on the count of three. Ready? One, two, three. Oh, we both said three. Yeah. That's good. Middle That's ground. Mi middle ground. Go for it. Yeah, uh, it's middle ground. You know, it's just the most amazing pizza in the world. No. Uh, will it get the job done? Yes. Picky eaters, kids, love it. Um, I understand why it's on the worst because, you know, you come to Disney and you're just kind of disappointed by a pizza party and you want more out of it. I get that. But, you know, it gets the job done. If you're hungry in a pinch. <laughs> There's some pizza. Yep, it's not ideal, but it is better, better. Than, than than the puffy pizza fari. Is uh, is Terra Treats? Yes. Literally across from Creature Comforts. There's a fun little pizza stand. I guess it's like a little a little pizza booth that you can yeah. get it from. It's more like a flatbread. It's not necessarily a flatbread, but it's more kind of flatbread style. They have cheese and they have pepperoni. It's definitely better, less greasy. Um, I enjoy it. Yeah. Better, better pizza. A couple of not great honorable mentions that also kind of fall in the worst category uh -huh. are uh, Restaurantosaurus. That's over in Dinoland USA, right? Yes. Yeah. yeah. Why, why, why is that Why is that honorable mention for you? For me, uh, it's pretty simple. It's bland food. It's not like wowing uh, theme park food. It does get the job done, kind of like Pizza Fari, but uh, definitely not the greatest. Honorable mention is anything from Rainforest Cafe. You Rain go for the experience on that one. Ish. Uh, it may rain inside there, but the food just do better. Yeah, do better. Uh, what do you think about our list? Uh, and it's not even our list; it's your list. It is your list. What do we think? These are the worst snacks we you, we could have had here at Animal Kingdom today. I agree. Uh, for the most part, yes, I agree. Definitely the Pandora Rock, purple rock thing from One Traders. That was disgusting. That was the worst thing I could have ever had. Tough man. Definitely, I think the pizza gets the job done. Ice cream is amazing, but I understand why it's on the worst list. I think the only thing I would have taken off that list was Pizza Fari because I'm like, Rrr. yeah, it's, like, it's pizza. It's pizza, like whatever. But yes, a lot of the snacks you found are definitely the worst. Not not great. So thanks for thanks for putting us through that. Thank you. We really appreciate it. If you like this video, go ahead and like and subscribe. Now go check out the best snacks here at Walt Disney World.